Growing up as a child, I had always loved picture books. I just like how the pictures are. You open them, the pages are just so beautiful. I had always wanted to design my own books, but I never really had the opportunity to learn how to design. But three years ago, I discovered a software called Canva, where I just need to drag and drop. And so in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how you can design your own children's book. If you've always had that kind of dream like me, how easy it is to use Canva Canva and design your own children's book you actually don't need any skills you just need to learn how to drag and drop so I actually have this children's book that I just launched on the 15th of February please you can check it out on Amazon or on my website at thefintamukong.com please I'll encourage you to get a copy for a chai and then after that please leave an honest review for that book thank you so much so we are going to be using canva to design this book if you don't yet have canva please you can go to the description box down below and sign up for a one month free trial I'm going to put every link that I'm talking about in this video in the description box down below some of them are affiliate links where if you buy something I'm going to have a small commission at no cost to you so when you go to canva.com your canva page is going to open here then let's begin our creation let's change this to inches and our book is going to be 8.5 by 8.5 so we create so this is our design um, I'll encourage you to click on this video that I already did that will help you to at least see how to design the interior and all of that but in this video i'm just going to be showing you how to design your picture book i have a short story that i wrote i'm just going to put the short story on the screen so you could pause the video and maybe just read it but the long and short about it is that lucy is a chicken and she really wanted to learn how to fly but her friends her other chicken friends don't believe that such a thing can happen to her so they laugh at her that she's not able to fly but with determination faith courage hard work lucy was able to achieve her dream so that's just a long and short about the story so let's start designing our story so every time when you want to design in Canva, there are so many things in Element. You just come here to Element. You search for whatever you want to do. So um, we need a background. Um, because I've used these things, if I go to see or I'll see the different, different things that I've used. For example, if you had not done this, you can go here and just say like, um, let's say cartoon um, forest. You can just put anything that comes to your mind. So you see, there are just many different designs. You can take a design like this. You see, look at how beautiful that is. Children book have a kind of beauty. So you can just come here, take any of these pictures. So when you are designing it, make sure that there is space where you'll be able to write the story. Right now we need something like the sky. So just look and see what you like. I don't know what you think about this one. So now we can send this to the back. Yeah, I think it looks good. So we could put like a tree. Okay, let's use this tree. The tree is growing from the ground. So let's put it like this. And then we can use a chicken house so anything that you are looking for just go to search and type like chicken house it's going to come out and then now we need to look for our chicken i don't like this one so okay look at this when you click on this chicken you see how it comes out with many different colors here it's just showing that you can change the color so let's reduce this chicken and maybe we can put the chicken somewhere here so that it looks as if the chicken is in its house let's make it a little bit smaller now i think we can change its color the white part let's the areas that are white okay let's do this yep maybe we can give lucy something like a tie just just be creative just do it anyhow you want it to be okay let's say 
Okay, we can give Lucy like a bow tie, right? I'm just giving you ideas, things that you can do. Since it looks almost the same color with its body, we can change the color of the bow tie to maybe green. Oh, let's take purple, yeah. So let us put our text here. Let's just take a text and put here for our story so that we can look at the story and know exactly how we are designing it. So that is too big. You can come here and reduce it. And then I don't like the writing. I like to use something like this. Yep. That looks good. So you just need to think, you need to be creative and think of ideas that can make your story captivating to children. So maybe um, Lucy used to see birds flying in the sky. We don't know. So we can just take like birds and put somewhere here. So we need to reduce the size of the bird so that it's not too big compared to Lucy. So maybe... Maybe Lucy used to see birds that are flying in the sky and then she's like, I wish I could fly like that bird. Maybe. Okay, yeah, we can just put other birds here flying like that. And just make sure that you don't put anything that you don't want to cut by the edges of the book. So let's turn Lucy so that she can be looking up. Maybe she's looking at the birds up and she's admiring them and wishing that she was the one who was able to fly. So after that, you come here, when you are done with that page, you can, if you want to keep the same design, then that's fine. Um, let's say that we, they are in a different place, right? Let's say that Lucy now maybe, Lucy might have, moved and when i met her other chicken friend so let's see if there's a beautiful tree that, oh we can use this so lucy can come here and maybe she's talking with her other chicken friends so what we can do is that we can just duplicate this one and then paste. Now we can flip it, come here and flip. Now it's looking on this other direction. So what you can do is that you can copy this and just paste. Let's say we have how many of them? And we can just open them. So these are Lucy's friends. These are the other chickens who are like laughing at her, right? So we have all these different, different chickens here. One, two, three, four, five, six. So now what we can do is that we can change the color. We can make this one, let's say another color, make this one. red we just change the colors <laughs> so look at the chickens now so we can change the colors of the chickens like this and now these are the different different chickens that we have what else can we do to make this page interesting we can just add some other things here to make the page look more attractive so this is the first page this is the second page of our book now the second page says that her friends laugh and thought that was impossible right? that's our second page you just need to take your time to design your book we can just duplicate this and then it's still the same thing so our next page is like that so lucy at this point lucy felt something carrying her off the ground so, so at this point, Lucy is flying, right? So she's flying and going to the air. So we can put her there flying. And then what we can do is that we can turn all her friends. We can flip her friends to be surprised with what is happening. 
since Lucy is flying, look at, we can do this and make them to look up. And it's like they are so shocked that Lucy is flying. So they are all looking up how Lucy is going. And these ones, they are also looking up. So our chickens, see how they are looking up. Lucy is flying and going and it's so surprising to them. The age of the child will also determine the length of words that you are putting here. It should not be too much if it's for younger children. Now, let's bring Lucy. Lucy has finally arrived on the tree. <laughs> she has been flying until she's up. Wow. So let's put Lucy somewhere here. They are just surprised to see her going. Like it just illustrated the story and they are looking and everybody is really surprised how Lucy is going. So how many pages did we make? So this one was different, unique, one, two, three, four. So you see how the book looks. And then at the end, when you are done with all your pages of your book, you come here, you now go to download. And then see we have four pages right here. You make sure you change this PNG to print, to PDF print. So you now download PDF print. So you can see our book that we just designed. So that's the first page. That's Lucy flying. So that is the book. See, it's, it's so beautiful, so colorful. Thank you so much for watching this video to the end. I hope that you go and create something beautiful. Remember this year, we are working toward having five different sources of income. So this is one thing that you can start doing and you can create so many different books. And like I said before, you can follow this video and see how to design your cover, how to upload it to KDP and begin to sell and make some money. Thank you so much for watching this video to the end. Love you all. Bye bye. When time has passed, I only love. Cause I could not bring myself to try.